Hi, I'm Tony Van Veen, CEO of Tastemakers. Happy Thanksgiving. Hopefully, by now, you've kind of emerged from your post-turkey coma, and I fear you may already be in a bit of a holiday shopping frenzy, if you're like most people. So let me stop you for a minute before your next mad dash to the mall and ask you this. Christmas is three weeks away. The new year, 2025, is one week after. Have you given any thought to how to make the most of these next four weeks for your music? First off, let's talk about the holidays, shall we? We just passed Black Friday, the biggest shopping day of the year. I don't need to tell you that in general, like it or not, the holiday season is a big shopping season. So how can you make the most of all these people looking for Christmas and Hanukkah gifts? Well, make sure you have stuff to sell them and let them know about it. If you have some product, LPs, CDs, t-shirts, sitting on a shelf or in your basement or in your garage, this is the time to let your fans in on that secret. I mean, a vinyl LP at a $30 price point is the perfect affordable Christmas gift. And by the way, even if you don't have product available, if you have a master recorded, our CD turn times at Disc Makers are so fast, we could probably rush out a small order of some awesome looking CDs for you before Christmas. But let's say you have some product you could sell. What do you do? Well, as I mentioned, for starters, let fans know about it. Send them an email, tie it into the holidays, include a prominent link to where your product is available for sale on your website. Don't have a website? You can build one quickly and easily with the help of our friends at Banzoogle. Or instead, just set up a store page on Bandcamp and direct your fans there. Of course, you'll want to do some social media messaging too with links to your site or your Bandcamp page. To get fans excited and to actually drive some real sales, you should consider a special offer. Give your fans a discount they otherwise couldn't get. Or make some special bundle, like if a CD was normally $15 and a t-shirt was $20, offer both for like $29. Still plenty of profit for you and certainly something the fans could get excited about. And if you happen to have any performances lined up for over the next month or so, be sure to let your fans know about those too, of course. And again, you can make some kind of special offer, like, you know, first 50 people or 25 people to buy a ticket, get a free copy of my CD. One final tip for making the most of your holiday selling season, don't assume people will see your email or your social post the first time you send it. People are really busy this time of year. They'll miss that email or that Insta story. So make sure to message your fan base a couple of times between now and Christmas, at least twice, maybe three times. If you do this, message your fans a few times and offer them a special deal or discount, you'll be sure to maximize your opportunities for the holidays this year. So those activities get you through the first three weeks in December, then Christmas, and then 2025 is right around the corner. And here is how you make good use of that last short week in December. Take some time for yourself to do some planning and some goal setting for what you want to accomplish next year with your music and think about how you're going to get there. New album, summer tour, more regular performances throughout the year, finally release your music on vinyl. What's your goal? Spend a bit of time thinking about what you want to accomplish next year. Make that list of goals. A couple of years ago, I did one of these videos on my personal end of year goal setting routine. I'm not going to talk about all of it now. I will link to it in the comments below if you're interested in checking it out. I think you might find it helpful. And I'll also add a link to a video I did about how to then crush those goals next year. So yeah, year is almost over, but the work isn't. Sure, Take this weekend to relax or do a bit of shopping and then set yourself up for a solid December and a great 2025 by following the tips I just discussed. Happy Thanksgiving. I'm thankful 
you've watched my videos this year, added your comments, sent me your emails, and supported Dismakers for your physical media needs. I'll see you next time.